everybody, it's me, Kimberelli09 from Hookah Pro and on YouTube. <laughs> and I'm coming at you with another Shisha review thanks to SaharaSmoke.com and their wonderful summer contest. Um, it's my first review out of box number two. I'm kind of doing a Cadillac trot here through the <laughs> through the whole contest, but um, yeah. Um, before I begin my review, I have to let you know that I just got a brand new hookah, a uh, new KM, and, um, I'm, I'm kind of learning how to use it, so, um, I'm going to talk to you mostly about the flavor of the shisha. Um, yeah. Well, the review I have for you today is hookah hookah chai. Um, you might be asking yourself, what is chai? And you might not even know if there wasn't a nice little teapot on the cover. Chai is a very spicy kind of tea. It's um, like a spicy black tea. Um, I'm a tea freak, so I know this and I drink chai. I'm not a big coffee person, actually. When I go to Starbucks, a lot of times I'll get like a tea or even like a chai latte. Um, but yeah. So, um, when I first got this sample, I was totally excited, totally down to try it because I like tea. Um, yeah, I opened it up, and I have to say of all the samples I've got, this one was the most interesting smelling, so um, I'll give it a quick smell for you. There's so many ways to describe it. Um, the first time you smell this... <laughs> It kind of smells like Windex. Please don't necessarily take that in a negative way, even though it sounds like it should be. Um, it's got a very potent, kind of pungent smell to it. And, um... But it's not in a bad way, you know, like Windex tea, who wants to smoke that? But <laughs> it kind of, um, it does have a little bit of that smell. But, um, the thing that I really loved about the smell is, like, it's like you first you get that kind of Windexy smell because it's so strong, and then you're like, oh, it's tea. <laughs> it smells just like a cup of hot tea, hot black tea. Um, very strong. Um, yeah, uh, <laughs> it it's a good thing. I I really liked the smell. I'm a really unique person, so I really like the smell and. Um, Another thing I liked about it is that it really kind of lingers in your nose. <laughs> like you get the inhale, you get like the the smell, but then it, it kind of sticks with you for a little bit. And maybe like after a couple of other breaths, you kind of get more of a citrus, kind of very, very light citrus aftertaste kind of thing going on. Um, it's, it's unique. <laughs> I don't think this is for everybody. It's definitely not for everybody. Uh, so, yeah. I was intrigued right away by the smell. It was the first one that I was like, ooh, gotta try this one. So, um, I plugged it into my hookah, and it, it, it tastes like how it smells. It's, it's bitter. Um, it, it is bitter. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Um, I don't know what to say. It's it's really unique. Um, if you like tea, you'll, you'll like this. If you don't like tea, I don't know. I would say tread cautiously if you're um, not a tea person, if you're not very adventurous, because it's, it's very, very different than anything I've ever had. Um, yeah. So, it, it tastes a lot like it smells. Um, it's kind of on in the inhale, it's just like a burst on your tongue of like this bitter, like, oh, taste. But <laughs> a tea drinker will understand. A tea drinker will definitely understand and appreciate. So, um, and then, you know, on the exhale, it's kind of like, ah, it's, it's, it's soothing. I, I definitely like it. Um, I've said it before and I'll say it again. It is definitely unique. It's definitely not for everybody. Um, yeah, but I do like it. I would definitely consider getting more of it, um, 
it's like as I'm talking to you now, I'm still like developing whether I like it or not. I do like it. Would I get it again? Sure. Uh, I don't know if I would get like a kilo of it anytime soon, but I do like it. I think it is worth a try to someone that likes tea, someone that's not tread cautiously, get a shot of it. Um, but yeah. Um, as for the smoke, I can give you a demonstration of the smoke, but I'm having issues with my new hookah. I'm kind of learning how to use it, so the smoke that you do see, plus it's a windy day, so the smoke that you do see might not be accurate. Um, it might not be like what you would get. I'm sure, I really, really trust Hookah Hookah because they have great clouds for all of their products, and it's something on my end, not theirs, so if you're the clouds will be good. They'll be very good. It's just I'm having issues with my grommets and I'm learning how to set up this new hookah so um the clouds are definitely not going to be an issue for you. Um, I'll, I'll try it but you're not going to see that much because I'm something's screwy with my hookah that I have to figure out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not bad. Your your clouds will be fine. So ignore my clouds, but just for the heck of it here. I guess they're fine. I, I don't know. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I, I, I dig it. Um, it's not an everyday smoke either, I don't think. Um, it might go well with like a spice. If you were to mix it with something, it might go well with like a spice kind of thing, like a seven spice, even though I've never tried seven spice, but I've read about it. Um, it would go well with spicy flavors. If you're a spice person, you might like it too. But, um, yeah, so if I were to rate it, I'm going to go with a 7.5 for now. Um, yeah, 7.5 I would say. Um, if you don't like tea and you really want to try it, try a shot. Go for a shot first. If you like tea and you want to try it, uh, you can maybe do like a 50 gram or a 250 gram container at saharasmoke.com. Um, yeah, so... <laughs> I guess that's it. Um, thank you for watching, and hopefully I'll get my hookah issues sorted out. And um, yeah, stay tuned for the next video. I just got box number two, and there will be... How many do you get total? Five more reviews before I can get my next box, and it's really addicting getting these boxes. So yeah, thanks everybody for watching, and hopefully I will see you at Hookah Pro. And yeah, go to Sahara Smoke too. Okay, bye.